Hello folks, this is Ted White and what we're going to do today is a 3D video in tax effect with person standing outside, which is what you see here. Let's check it out. All right folks, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to click on create project and then we're going to import the clips we need to make this particular intro. So I'm going to click on import. From there, I'm going to click on this clip and click open. And then I'm going to click on import again. And I'm gonna go to a different location here. And I'm going to click on this clip right here and click open. Okay, so what I show here is this is Hello, folks. 15 seconds and I also show that this one is 14 seconds um, or 13 plus. So I want to make my text at least that long because uh, you want to hold the videos in it. Uh, you want it to be long enough for the videos and if you have to reduce the text that's quite all right. So I'm going to add the text to the track. I'm going to click on it and it defaults to three seconds long, okay? So then you can just increase that over this way, eight seconds, 12, 14, and I'm just gonna make it a little bit over 15. Okay, there we go, 15.26 seconds long. And then the next step you're going to do is you're gonna underneath text, you're gonna see basic and then default text and you're gonna change the text to 3D, okay? And then you're going to go to font right here. It's right now on system. We want it on a bolder font and a bolder font would be Anton. So I'm gonna click that and then what you do is you make sure that this is in the middle of the screen. So it's in the middle of the crosshairs here, right there. And then you increase the font size and make it as big as possible here so that you can get as much video in it as you can. Now it was showing in the middle, but I'm showing the D up here to be a little bit higher than the lower part. So I'm gonna bring this down a touch and try to get the sweet spot. Ooh, which is... I almost had it right about oh every time okay right about there it's close enough okay so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click I'm gonna make sure that this text clip is highlighted here and I'm just going to minimize a bit so you can see the whole thing it's highlighted. I'm going to right click on it and I'm going to clip on, uh, click on create compound clip. Okay. So the compound clip has been created and we actually want the compound clip to be the background, which is right beside cover in my version of CapCut PC. Okay. The next thing we want to do is we want to go back to import and then we're going to put in our background video which is going to show up the video is going to show up in the text so i'm going to add that track to the timeline it's automatically going to go down to the main background and what i'm going to do is i'm going to click on that and i'm going to bring it up and then the crosshair which is the blue uh, horizontal line which is right above three the 3d compound clip shows you that it's going to land right above the 3d co compound clip and that's where we want it to go okay and what we want to do now is we want to make sure that this clip is highlighted which it is we're going to go up to under video and then under basic we're going to scroll down to blend we're going to open up blend and then we're going to see mode mode is listed as default right now we're going to go down scroll down to multiply and we're going to click on that okay and now all of a sudden the video is showing within the text and that's exactly what we want okay so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add myself to the video Hello. and i'm going to drag it down 
and see if it just stops right there, and it does, okay? Um, rather than adding the track, if you add the track, it will automatically go down as the background video, but if you drag it down and make sure the crosshair, the, the blue line is above the middle uh, clip, it will fall into place and be above all the clips here. So the next step we want to do is we want to remove the background for this particular video right here. So this is highlighted, this clip is highlighted under video, basic, beside basic, there's remove BG. This might be cut out uh, for you and this might be auto cut out. This is a pro feature on my version of CapCut. I'm going to click it right here. It's gonna take some time. I will give it a minute and come back. Okay, as you can see now, the cutout has been completed and I look huge. I look like I'm ruining the entire video because I'm uh, way too big for this particular frame. So I'm gonna fix that. I'm gonna make sure that this is highlighted and the background has been removed. So it's just me that's going to be in this. So I'm actually going to take this, the size of this, and I'm going to minimize it and make it pretty small. I don't mind because I want to make sure that everyone can see this 3D background here. Okay, there we go. So there I am. Uh, I'm going to reduce the volume just because it echoes here. So I'm just actually going to turn the volume down and we're just going to visually uh, check and make sure everything's okay here. I will fool around with the volume after I'm done this tutorial. Okay, so I can see I'm not in the middle, so I need to get in the middle. And I, I just want to make myself a little bit smaller so I can show off a bit more of the text and video within the text. So let me just play that. Okay, visually it looks pretty good, except for this looks horrendous. Um, that's unacceptable and that's not going to be going live. Uh, there'd be big, big problems if it was. Um, so that looks good. Uh, I am just going to... Okay, so before... Before I open my mouth... I'm just going to go right here and I'm going to show you a little trick that I that I do here. I'm going to split this and I am going to be raising the volume for this but for the purpose of this video there's going to be an echo if I raise the volume and uh, it's not going to sound good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just show you a nice little trick here. Uh, so this is highlighted, this clip is highlighted, and I'm going to go to basic, I'm going to go down to opacity, and I'm going to make that zero, and then I'm going to click on the keyframe, and so that's, I'm invisible right now, and then I'm going to bring it over here, so this is, I know that this is before I open my mouth, and here I'm gonna change this to 100% so it kind of gives a ghost like entrance here um, so let me just take a quick look at this there we go and I arrive out of nowhere isn't that sweet um, okay so that looks good I am going to exit out of that so the I'm pleased with the front part and with the back part here Okay, and this is where I pretty much say let's take a look type thing. Um, let's check it out is what I usually say. Okay, so I'm going to go right here and uh, I'm going to make sure that this clip is highlighted. I see that I'm not saying anything anymore. I'm going to have the opacity. I'm going to put a keyframe right here and it's going to be at 100% and that's going to add a keyframe here. And then I am going to 
go until my fingers are still up and then I am going to add another keyframe here which will add a keyframe here and it did the same over here by the way they just automatically add once you add them over here they add over um, they add over here as well okay so you add it here it adds there okay so that looks good um, so that's zero. I'm just gonna take this up a little bit more. The playhead move the the playhead a little bit more, and make sure I'm completely disappeared. And then I'm gonna make sure this is highlighted. I'm going to split, and I'm going to get rid of this. So right click, go up to delete, and then I'm going to split this. Right click, delete. And then I'm going to split this. Right click, delete. Okay. So, let me just make sure. Maybe I, what is this? 100. And let me just look at the opacity. Oh, I made a mistake. I didn't put it at zero. Enter. There. I'm disappeared. Excellent. Um, that that would have been a big big non catch there okay i'm going to play this and i'm going to put the volume up um you're going to hear feedback okay uh and that's just the way it works um uh when we're recording like this so i'm going to put it on full screen oh i forgot to put the volume up just hold on uh, volume. So I'm just putting the volume up on this particular clip. So I have this highlighted. The volume is completely off and I'm just going to put it to zero for this one. And we will press play from the beginning. Hello folks, this is Ted White and what we're going to do today is a 3D video in tax effect with person standing outside, which is what you see here. Let's check it out. Okay, I think that looks pretty good. And I'm not showing anywhere. I completely disappeared at the end and I was complete, completely disappeared at the beginning. So I know this was a lengthy tutorial, but I'm just trying to give you folks an idea and maybe you can, um, you know, figure out something even more creative than this, but this will give you the basic tools if you haven't seen it already, okay? Anyway, I hope this helped you out, and I hope you have a great day. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.